we oftentimes get too excited about technology first and we believe that technology can change everything and it can do some magic in the education space. Yes, technology is an enabler. Technology can make new things possible. But at the same time, it has to be integrated with the right type of content and pedagogical models. Uh, without such integration, technology will be fancy gadgets. So I hope that more people will be looking at the entire education ecosystem and pick the right and effective technology that will support the pedagogy. And that's what I would like to share with people and more and more. Um, so uh, that's something that we have to keep in mind. Technology alone cannot make the kind of difference that we want it to. In terms of use of technology in the higher education space, uh, there are many possibilities. Um, so I'll talk about the positive side first and then the negative side. The positive side, I think that social network channels uh, enable new kind of learning opportunity for students. Students can collaborate with uh, peers in different countries and use various media channels to exchange ideas and advance knowledge. Those are very, very exciting uh, part. The negative side is it has to do with the cultural DNA and social DNA, meaning that people don't change their perceptions very quickly. Even if they realize the benefit of using technology to make things more efficient and effective, they still want to do the things that they have been doing uh, for the last 20, 30 years, <laughs> meaning that People don't change their behaviors overnight. Uh, so they will probably uh, teach, the teachers will probably teach the same way they have been taught. And that will be the case for many years to come. As uh, someone who loves uh, technology and uh, integration of technology in the right pedagogy, I would love to show more best practices, good users of technology, to convince people that uh, there are a lot of benefits that technology can bring to the education space. At the same time, researchers need to uh, do a better job in terms of finding the real significant impact that technology can bring to the education space and share that uh, with the uh, uh, general public because it cannot be just innovative solutions in the labs. It may seem innovative, but uh, if it is not innovative in the real world, uh, what good is it? So uh, people need to share more ideas, and people need to exchange best practices, and share the data so that, that people can be convinced to use technology. And by doing all these, I think that higher education will benefit tremendously. The decision makers will be uh, making decisions to incorporate good technology tools, proven tools, uh, to uh, really innovate the learning space in the 21st century. So I hope uh, that uh, we'll see some significant changes down the road, uh, but probably it will require some uh, perception change, DNA change, uh, more, more on the people side before we can really see the uh, changes that technology can really uh, cause to uh, make difference.